Hello there. You were expecting Joe, weren't you? But I said you got me. I'm the interviewer now. Don't worry, Joe is still gonna show up on videos. We just decided to try something different for a while and I'll be doing some interviews because I want to try something new, you know? Get comfortable uh, talking to people and stuff and being on camera. So here I am. Now you're probably wondering, who's this handsome fellow you see on the screen? Well, what's your name? Colin. Colin? Colin yeah. His name's Colin. As for me, don't worry about it, I'm nobody. So anyway, what we're asking people today is why did they pick SFU over any of the other schools? Are they happy with their choice? Could SFU be improved somehow? This is Vancouver Talks. Um, okay, so... <laughs> so obviously you're here at SFU studying. Why did you pick SFU over any other school? Well, honestly, SFU was just the closest. Like, UBC, I would need to be traveling, like, you know, four hours a day, just, like, there and back on the 14. Like, SFU is, like, just a 25-minute bus ride from here. And plus, it's just a good school. My sister goes here, and, like, yeah. she, you know, it's just, like, a good environment, you know. Okay. Kind of like how it's a bit smaller. Was that the only reason you picked uh, SFU? Yeah. Oh, I also got accepted here, so oh, yeah. that was also <laughs> a big reason, right? Why did you pick SFU over any other school? <laughs> um, should I answer this honestly? Because yeah. <laughs> I'm going to get into UBC. <laughs> fair, enough. fair enough, fair enough. What, um, what about you? Because uh, I didn't want to go anywhere else? I don't know. So, like, do you have any plan like, for why you want to go here, why you want to go to school at all? Yeah, I originally wanted to be a lawyer, um, but I'm switching that over to being a pilot, so I'm going to switch my degree from... Uh, arts to sciences, and then get my pilot's licenses. Okay. Um, as for like a plan, I kind of just wanted to go to school or like be surrounded by academics. i not really yeah. going into, I'm third year now, so obviously I have a plan to like finish my degree and stuff like that. But going into it, I just wanted to be in the environment of learning. Honestly, um, I'm from Manitoba, and it was either go to University of Manitoba, or I'm actually related to Ryan, and his family was like, yeah, why don't you come out here for university? So I came out to SFU just to see something different, okay. just to see Vancouver, yeah. And it has like everything you're looking for like, to study? Yeah, uh, we're both uh, computer science majors and uh, the computer science program has been great. It's hard, um, it's really pushing us, but it, it's been good. Same for you? Uh, for me it was the money, like I couldn't really afford to go away. Like uh, I got into Waterloo, which was my dream school, but it's about a 30 grand tuition there. Shit. And yeah. um, it's the exact yeah. like the exact same program at SFU, so I was like, sure, I don't get the same university experience by commuting, but uh, I get the exact same education, and that's all I really needed. How much does it cost here? It's about eight thousand a year. Okay. Yeah. Mm. Wow. <laughs> yeah, it's a big difference. Yeah. Yeah. Um, at first, I did want to go to another school, but I find that SFU offers a really good monetary like support for students. And then, upon further research, I really liked how it had a good reputation. Lots of programs where it had a good reputation as well. So now I'm here. So you're happy with your choice? I'm happy with my choice, Okay. Yeah. What year are you here? Second year. Second year, okay. Obviously you picked SFU for a reason. Why did you come here instead of any other school? Well, I heard it was a good environment uh, compared to other schools. Uh, less competitive, more compassionate. General vibe was something I was thinking it was going to be good. So that's why I showed up. And like, are you happy with your choice? Yeah, so far so good. Uh, this is my first year on campus, uh, so you know, I think it's as best it could be. Uh, everyone's relatively nice, and even even the restaurants and uh, shop owners here are really good. The service is really good, so it just seems like an overall nice experience. What about like uh, the courses or the the cost, the time, the travel, whatever? Well, those things were factored in as well. Like I, I live about 20 minutes away, so it's really nice. I don't have to like the commute is low, mm. right? So it makes a difference. Um, I, I grew up around this area, so like the school's known to me for a while, right? It has it has good prestige added to it, right? Mm. It's a it's not the best school in the world. It's not the worst school in the world. It's right in the middle. They they consistently get better, and that's what I like. Right? Okay. You guys chose S S F U for a reason. Why? Um, my mom went here, so I thought it was the easiest option. Yeah. Yeah. How about you? Uh, I just I just liked it here out of all my other options. Like, are you happy with it so far? Yeah, yeah. 
I like it a lot here. What's the best part of, about it? Oh, we're taking our classes together, yeah, so that's yeah. nice. We, Definitely. Yeah, and it, uh, I don't know. I don't know, yeah. <laughs> uh, the, I was planning to do the business program, and the SFUBD school is like the best in yeah. Vancouver, Canada maybe. Yeah, I feel very confident in my choice. Okay. You don't regret anything? Uh, sometimes I wish I went to UBC for the engineering program, but... Mm. Oh, because I got accepted to it and it was close to my place, so yeah. Okay. yeah. How about you? Uh, I'm from like uh, another country and this like the weather here is similar to that. Also, I got accepted and the uh, ranking for my uh, bachelor part is high. Okay. I honestly didn't check all of that. So. Did you like check any of the other schools, like what you were interested in? Well, I did check UBC, and I did live in the UBC area for a while, but like I just didn't want to be there anymore. So yeah. Okay. You happy with your choice? I'm really happy with my choice. I love SFU. What's something that SFU is missing that would make it a better school? I'm not that sure. I'm only first year, so like uh, okay. haven't really experienced a lot of the. Uh, environment around us few but uh i think i just need to stay here a bit longer to that makes have an idea makes sense i don't know if it's just because uh we aren't staying on residence or anything like that we're staying in north vancouver um but i feel like we've really been missing like the community aspect like meeting new people and things like that mm -hmm. it could also be because half of our classes are online oh, yeah. so i'm really looking forward to classes being yeah all in person again so i have a better chance to meet people and get to know my peers and yeah. who's going to school with mm -hmm. me and stuff like that yeah, like the same thing, like we don't know like almost anybody in our like calculus class. We have like a group chat of like 15 people and that's all we know. Yeah. So definitely getting back to in-person class is going to help a lot to social life. Is there something that SFU is lacking that you wish it had? Color. <laughs> that's <And> true. <laughs> it's very gray. And also like uh, a little bit more social life because it's really just study, 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 study. Maybe just a little bit of time for social. Yeah, that's people true. Together. People seem very isolated here. Yeah. The Student Union building is a new building. It wasn't here before. Before that, like there wasn't any place you could go with your yeah, friends and just. I think since it, you know, everyone calls it a commuter school because not mm. many people. There's not as much of a culture on campus. I think they're really trying to fix that, but it's. I think it has a bit of a long way ahead of it. Does this building help? <laughs> that this new, building uh, definitely helps. Yeah. It is busy all the time, I find. It's kind of hard to find a spot, so mm. I'm happy they built it, though. But do people, like, talk to each other much here or no? I find that if you're in the cafeteria area, it's really chatty. Yeah. I'm not sure if those are people meeting each other for the first time or they're already friends, but mm. there's a lot of conversations going on for sure. Um, is there something about SFU that you find, like, it's lacking, like, it could be better somehow. Hmm. I mean, lacking. What's lacking about SFU? <laughs> I, could, I could tell the benefits about SFU. It has like this roof. You don't get wet when you're trying to get to your classes. The community is really nice. People are really nice. Everyone's so friendly. There are a lot of international students, which makes life interesting, especially in dorms. The dining hall is awesome when it actually existed. But um, negative things about SFU, honestly, I had a really good experience in SFU, so I, I don't have anything. Does that have to be negative? Just maybe just something like you wish it had? Maybe if, it, if the clubs were taken more seriously. For example, like I'm Persian, and apparently there is a Persian club, but it's very much, in my opinion, dead. Yeah. I'm not sure. I'm not really a fan of the online classes, but like, they, we can't really do anything about that now. But Have you explored much? Have you tried different stuff, clubs, join anything? No, not. I feel like I've been way too caught up on just trying to figure out a whole school thing that I haven't had a chance to take a look at the clubs and stuff, mm -hmm. which kind of sucks. But Your third year, what, what year First are you? Year. First year. What's something that uh, SFU is missing that would make it a better school? I've been here for two months, so I don't know. Um, more of a student life, I guess. It's hard to do that when it's a commuter school, right? Mm -hmm. Like, I spend an hour a day commuting to and from school, so better accessibility, I guess. Uh, I agree. I'm on campus this semester, like, living here, and it sucks so far. Like, 
it's just nobody t has wants to talk to anybody and there's no like yeah sure there's like opportunities but like bare, I can't, like I can't even say that um, what's something that SFU is lacking that you wish it had I don't know I, ha I can't really compare it to any other university because I've never been mm. so I can only say that it's as good as it could be relative to really nothing because I don't have no comparison. Well, maybe not as a comparison, but just like something you wish you could do here, something you wish it had something that would make it better somehow. Uh, maybe like uh, similar to UBC, add fraternities. Mm, okay. You know, give it something of a party vibe because it, it, could, it could potentially turn into something good, right? Getting more people together, mm. being able to hang out for for a particular cause or whatever it, you know frats stand for i have noticed like the people here are kind of different than the people from ubc yeah like yeah. It, it is that a lot, i think a lot more people are are shyer here mm. because uh, the That's social right. culture hasn't been developed the same way so um i think that the fraternities would help uh social aspects of the school but other than that i don't think anyone is rude there's like some trade-offs for it right mm. like um, i think social cir uh, circles tend to create like too much uh too much segregation because then you're part of a group mm. everyone here is kind of free for all so it's kind of like okay you can kind of hang out with anyone or whoever you want thanks for watching uh let me know what you guys think let us know if you want to see more of me and if you don't well then screw you <laughs> anyway um you don't know what to do share like subscribe and all that and uh i'll see you next time it's great out So it does seem like a lot of people feel isolated here, feel pretty lonely. Oh. Do you have any advice on how they could overcome that, like make friends, meet people? I'm so thirsty right now. Do you want to take a picture of our card so you sure, know what to yeah. look for? <laughs>